I'm going to try to get off one maul on the boss right on the pull this time. That way my priest won't be as likely to pull healing aggro on him. This is a clip from episode 17 of my multiboxing classic WoW series. Link to the full episode in the description. I DPS the snakes down one at a time while generating AoE threat on my druid with swipe or demoralizing roar. I don't want to AoE down the snake since my druid could lose threat, and if I bring the boss close to my casters, his holy nova and holy wrath will deal massive AoE damage. Snakes down. Oops, forgot my first mana pots, just popped them. Oh, I forgot to use my Scorch and Fireball cast sequence on my mage. Turning my shaman around to save mana for the second phase. It's actually pretty chill in this phase right now. I can hang out here a while, and I still have Innervate for my priest. Evocation on my mage. Oh crap, I just interrupted the evocation. That's not good. I'm gonna need that mana going into the second phase. I'm actually just gonna chill here for a bit and let my DPS regen some mana. I'm still pretty safe and I still have Innervate to use on my priest. Don't want the Scorch stacks to drop though. Okay, Innervate on my Priest and Stone Shield Potion on my Druid. Let's start the DPS back up. I need to get him to 50% now. The boss goes into Phase 2 at 50% health. He'll start to deal a lot more damage to my Druid and I'll be in a race against the clock. DPS cooldowns popped, time to phase him. There's a Venom Spit, I'm gonna inner focus Prayer of Healing to make sure no one dies to the next Venom Spit or Poison. I do still have a Poison Cleansing Totem down though. I missed killing that parasite and stayed in the poison too long. I ended up panic casting Frenzied Regen. Second mana pots. I'm going into 20% and my team's mana is looking really good. Eight percent. Come on. Oh, baby, first attempt. That's what I'm talking about, dude. Hell yeah. I did it. A raid boss five man kill. I actually did it. It's been my goal since killing Dracosath to 5 mana raid boss. Only took me 4 months. Thank you everyone watching for being a part of this journey. It's been my pleasure to tell the story and I hope you've enjoyed it. You know, this might be the first time I've ever had raid boss loot entirely to myself. Let's see what I got. I actually forgot to start logging this fight. Didn't expect to get him on my first attempt of the night. 
DPS went about how it should have gone. My Shaman got about 9% more crits than he normally should have. Lucky me. But my Warlock was down about 6% crit than usual. I think it evened itself out. For those of you wondering, in the video description I have links for the gear and talents my boys used for this challenge. I finally got all the pieces in place to make it happen. So five of those Vinox's kills are with normal raid groups. I don't think I've ever wiped on this boss in a normal 20-man raid. That's 48 wipes for me to get my first 5-man raid boss kill. And thank you everyone who's been giving me tips and words of encouragement on my videos. It always means a lot to me to read those comments and see that people out there are enjoying the series. You know, I think I'm getting into a pattern. Every time I accomplish a goal, I get another goal or two in mind to start working on. I'll tell you all about it in the next video.